All right, we're going to cut these eggs open. What kind of eggs are these? These are from a het clown possible het pie to a het clown possible het pie. So we could produce a clown pie. Clown pie. So we're going to start giving these things a cut. What is it, Mr. Dole? That would be a possible head clown. That wasn't very exciting. Okay, let's try another one here. I suppose you guys want to see them, huh? We'll change the angle of this in a minute so you can see what's going on. What's that? That's another possible head clown. Another possible head clown. Okay, now let's change this real quick. Can I kill the fly? All right, while we were adjusting the camera, we cut this one open. And look what's in here. What is it? It's moved. Yeah, it has. It has moved. This is R1 and 16. This is what we were trying for. This is a piebald clown. And we're really excited. Probably not going to be able to see it too good. We'll get more pictures later. But there, that would appear to be it. That would be it. So here we'll show you cutting open another egg here and see what we have. We're hoping for another one. Uh-oh. I think it looks white. It's definitely white. Oh. That's what happens when you have people working for you that run into doors. Um, <laughs> the door just opened behind us and hit us. But here's a, a white snake. It's a pied ball. I can't tell if it's a pied clown or not, but it's definitely a piebald. So we'll have to uh, see what's going on in that one. And we'll try this last egg here. Although the color is definitely not the same between this one and this one. The color is definitely oh, brighter. It's got a little orange right there. Yeah, it does. But the pattern doesn't look right. So we'll check this last one here. I don't see any white on this one. Looks like a clown. Yeah, it's a clown. So, this would be a clown possible hep pie. And if this is just a pie, this would be a pied possible hep clown. And then this is this is the actual morph itself. A, uh, a pie ball clown. And as you can see, the orange on it's really bright. Can't wait for this to come out of the egg. Of that one. This one? Yeah, I got a close up right now. Yeah, that's really cool. I can't believe how bright it is. Pretty nice. So then the clown's right next to yeah, it there. Yeah, the clown. You see that head sitting right there. The air bubble. Hold on. And uh, there's then there's the, the pie. There's the pie. And then, uh, what do you it want is now. Do? After the interruptions of the door opening, <laughs> the door opened and hit me. So anyways, there they are. That's the uh, clutch. Um, that was pretty exciting to find this thing in here. We just can't wait for them to come out. Probably before you see this, we'll have pictures of it out. But that thing looks awesome. It does. No doubt, the best pied in the world. So, do you want to tell the story real quick? Oh, this, this um been working on this project since 2001 when I bought two females from Matt Turner that were the product of a het 
clown male bred to normal female and there was a piebald in the clutch. So I purchased the two females hoping that they'd be double hets and neither one of them turned out to be a het clown but one of them did turn out to be a het pied and I kept all of her offspring and uh, I just chose two of, two of the adult pair and bred them together and, and we hit the odds on it. They turned out to be double heads. So a seven year project? Yes, seven year project. Long time, seven years, and it panned out for her. And I admit I gave her a bad time most of the time thinking that they really were double heads, so she did good. All right, we'll see you next time. Back to the incubator they go. Yes.